Our democracy is under attack, and we got to fight for it. I taught at the University of Pennsylvania for four years, and I used to teach political theory. Well, that's a lie. Thirty years ago, Nelson Mandela walked out of prison and entered into discussions about apartheid. I had the great honor of meeting him. I had the great honor of being arrested with our UN ambassador on the streets of Soweto trying to get to see him on Robbins Island. Nope. And let's say one thing to rest. I may be a practicing Catholic. We used to go to 730 Mass every morning in high school and then in college before I went to the black church. Nope. Just imagine, I mean it sincerely. I say this as a father of a man who won the Bronze Star, the Conspicuous Service Medal, and lost his life in Iraq. Nope. How much advance notice did you have of the FBI's plan to search Mar-a-Lago? I didn't have any advance notice. None. Zero. Not one single bit. Nope. They pay somewhere between $400 and $700 a month. You know how much it costs to make it? The guy, I spoke to the guy who invented it, the insulin. He said he didn't patent it because he wanted it available for everybody. Nope. <laughs> We have the eighth largest black population in the country, and between all minorities, we have 20% of our state is minority. And so I, uh, I uh, was sort of raised uh, in the Puerto Rican community at home. Nope. Who well, I might add, I want to thank him for getting me off a mountain that was about 12 to 14,000 feet up on a goat path when our helicopter went down in a snowstorm. It's good to see you, General. The greatest bullshit story ever told. 